In this video, we'll be discussing the two different types of lineage within Calibra. Those two types are diagram, or otherwise known as business lineage, which gives an overview of how data moves. And then technical lineage, which allows you to see the underlying SQL code. Within an asset page, in this case I mean a data set, I can see the details of the asset and understand the data on it with its context. But what I want to do now is click on this diagram option and be taken into the business lineage. At its core, business lineage is the visual representation of the relations that have been built out within the platform. This location icon tells me that I am on this particular asset and we can add useful information such as quality score. From here, I can see the various relations that have been built and the visual flow of how data is used across the organization. I can see this data set contains information from this particular table, and I can see that the system has different databases through which data moves, from raw to refined and to consumption. I have different views up here to explore. You can think of the views as different lenses that can be configured to show different relations. So in this case, you can see there's a lot less assets here, which reduces the clutter. It's the same flow as we had before. And this really helps getting a good sense of where the data is being used to do impact analysis. For example, in case there's a quality issue in the table, what reports will be impacted? I can also use this view to display other relations. We have these three little dots. This allows you to show other relations that don't show by default. And we can then see that this data has a relation with the business term anonymization, is linked to the metric sales per customer, and it's related to the domain's product and order. This is all very useful to understand where data is moving. Now let's say that I wanted to get a look at the code itself. So that's what technical lineage is used for. I'm gonna click on this customer product sales table and dig in. I'm now on the table and I'm going to go down to technical lineage. And this allows me to see how the data transforms from source to destination. I'm going to zoom all the way out here. And we can see different objects that are related to this table, like other tables, columns, and BI tools. The yellow boxes are objects which are also governed within Calibra versus the gray boxes, which are objects like temporary tables that are not in Calibra, but our lineage harvester has parsed. From here, I can inspect the underlying SQL code and see how data transformed. I'm also able to scroll through the databases and tables. So for example, if I wanted to check the Tableau report and the specific columns that it's using from the database upstream, and if I wanted to dig deeper on a specific column, I can use the column level lineage. And again, I can also inspect all the data transformation in a more isolated way. Using the business lineage, you can understand how the data is moving across the organization and its relations with its context. And the technical lineage can be used for technical users to see in greater detail the individual code and transformations.